Hey there, coin enthusiasts. Welcome back to Coin Oz. Today we are delving into the world of numismatics to uncover four highly elusive error coins that could be hiding in your collection, potentially worth big bucks. So hit that subscribe button below and let's get started. Number 4. 1943 Lincoln Cent Struck on a Silver Dime Planchet. Graded as AU50 by PCGS. According to Stax Bowers, an attractive and inviting example of a particularly popular wrong planchet error that exhibits mottled copper russet overtones to otherwise antique silver gray surfaces. Direct lighting calls forth faint traces of mint luster. In the haste of wartime production, a stray 90% silver planchet intended for dime coinage managed to find itself in the striking chamber intended for zinc-coated steel Lincoln cents, producing this sensational mistake. Lightly struck or otherwise missing design detail in areas, as is expected for the error, with pressure lacking between the dies due to the smaller flan. It was sold for $3,600. Number 3. 2002 D. Sacagawea dollar struck on a quarter planchet. Graded as MS66 by PCGS. This lustrous error coin weighs 5.6 grams. An interesting wrong planchet error created when a standard planchet for quarter got fed between Sacagawea dollar dies, this one produced at the Denver Mint. Visually striking for both the quality and the obviously incorrect composition. Well centered on the slightly smaller quarter blank, with good detail and narrow rims complete around the circumference on each side. Fully brilliant with exceptional cartwheels of luster and only the most trivial handling. It was sold for $5,280. Number 2. 1965 Roosevelt Dime Struck on a 90% Silver Planchet. Graded as AU55 by NGC. This is one of the most popular wrong planchet errors in today's market, a transitional one that involves a 90% planchet that the mint ceased using for regular issue dime production in 1964 with 1,965 dated dies from the first year of regular issue copper nickel clad coinage. Otherwise properly struck, although accuracy does compel us to mention trivial softness of detail along the left obverse and upper reverse borders. It ended up selling for $5,520. Number 1. 1983 Lincoln Cent Struck on a Copper Cent Planchet. Graded as MS63 Red and Brown by PCGS. According to Heritage Auctions, in many ways, this tantalizing mint error is similar to the 1943 Cent Struck on Bronze instead of zinc-coated steel. Apparently, a small number of copper-slash-zinc planchets were struck in 1983 instead of the mandated copper-plated zinc planchets, which weigh only 2.5 grams. This MS63 example is nice with generous amounts of red on both sides and purple-brown accents on the high points. It was sold for $18,800. And there you have it, folks, four rare and valuable error coins that could be lurking in your collection. Who would have thought that small imperfections could lead to such big bucks? If you enjoyed this exploration into the world of numismatic treasures, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below.